Well, I think one of the biggest differences uh, versus the past measures is that we do see the Chinese government is finally uh, not only throwing out policies uh, with different dots, but really connecting all the dots to uh, support the uh, real estate market. So we do see that uh, there is a broad measure, not only from lowering interest rate, but generally also on helping developers to uh, finishing the uh, rest of the units. There are also more support from the uh, a local government side on the uh, possibility to purchase some of the uh, unsold units as well. So I do see this is a more uh, all round uh, package compared to uh, what we have seen before. But of course, um, this may not be uh, totally enough. We do need to see these policies being really uh, implemented and interest rate will need to go down further. And especially, we are not quite sure about the size of the stimulus yet. So this will remain a big problem for home buyers. So uh, still uh, more to come, perhaps, an all-round package, but uh, do you think what's happened so far is going to start to make a difference? Well, um, if you look at some of the high-frequency uh, home transaction data, especially in the Tier 1 cities, there is indeed a bit of the improvement in the uh, transaction. However, whether that is a very meaningful uh, improvement that would be very long-lasting is quite uh, early to say uh, for now as well, because we have seen uh, previously uh, when uh, the government wrote out uh, other policies, then we do see a few weeks of the improvement, and then it kind of bounced back to the original level, which is around only 50% of the home sales versus the average of 2019 to 2021, which is the period, uh, period before the regulatory changes. So, um, yes, it's helpful, but it's hard to say how long it will last for now unless we see more uh, measures. What about consumer confidence? Uh, there can't be a recovery in the property sector without people willing to spend money in it. Well, I think if you look at um, the interest of household uh, right now, I do think the majority of the consumer would probably still prefer uh, saving. Uh, we do see a bit of the uh, flows uh, going towards investment, especially after the uh, equity market boom. But it kind of uh, calmed down a little bit and go back uh, uh, to the original uh, level right now. So it's hard to conclude that the consumer confidence has fully uh, rebounded right now. Of course, there's still more improvement in terms of the lower down payment and also the lower interest rate in terms of the mortgages, all of this are going to help uh, improving the confidence. But we need to see a bigger uh, scale of the uh, policy being implemented to actually see something that is uh, more meaningful. So the, the direction is clear, but it just needs to be done more.